Before donning the mask, visually inspect it for damage, deformation, or uncleanliness. Afterwards, attach Explore Bayonet filters. Make sure to align the indicator mark on the filter and mask, then turn the filter in the direction of the arrow. Pull the lower strap over your head. Please note that with the Explore 3500, you must first connect the hooks on the neck strap. Position the face piece over your mouth and nose and pull the head cradle over the head resting on the crown. Pull both straps forward uniformly until the face piece fits securely and comfortably against your face. You can perform either a negative or a positive pressure check to test the seal of the mask. For a negative pressure check, seal both filters with your hand and breathe in until a negative pressure is generated. Hold your breath for a few seconds and negative pressure should be maintained. If not, reposition the face piece and adjust the straps. Repeat the test until a successful fit check is achieved. Alternatively, for the negative pressure check, both respiratory filters could be sealed with an aid such as a flat piece of rubber, cardboard, plastic, or foam. For the positive pressure check, seal the exhalation valve with the palm of your hand and exhale. The half mask should inflate slightly. If the exhaled air leaks out of the mask around the sealing line, reposition the face piece and adjust the straps. To doff the mask, loosen the straps, then pull the harness from your head and remove the mask. When doffing the Explore 3500, first unclasp the hooks on the neck strap and then pull the mask down. This drop-down strap system allows you to remove the mask from your face without removing a hard hat or face shield. To doff the mask completely, pull the harness from your head. Before cleaning the mask, remove the filters and disassemble the mask. Please make sure to review the maintenance intervals stated in the IFU. Afterwards, check and clean the exhalation and inhalation valves. If the valves are deformed or damaged, they must be replaced. Otherwise, the valves may be reused. The mask body and head harness should be cleaned with an all-purpose detergent and rinsed in lukewarm water. For recommended detergent, see the IFU. In addition to the cleaning, a disinfecting should follow using the disinfectants listed in the IFU. Afterwards, rinse thoroughly in running water. After cleaning, press the valve disc into the valve seat then reassemble the mask completely. When your equipment needs a quick clean, for example in training situations or during breaks, you can use an alcohol-free respirator wipe. Please note that this does not replace cleaning procedures described in the IFU. This cleaning method should only be used temporarily in situations where the mask is used by one individual. 